Hey YouTube, what's up? It's iPod Touch for Life 165 here. And in this video, I got a full untethered jailbreak for you guys for every single iDevice. However, the highlights of this jailbreak is that it'll jailbreak the newest iPod Touch 3rd generation and uh, both models of the iPad, which were just newly released, uh, as well as the iPhone 3GS, which has been used on a tethered jailbreak um, if you have the newer model. So, um, one of the uh, things you will need is to be on version 3.1.2, 3.1.3, or 3.2, obviously, if you have the iPad. And this will work on every single iDevice, actually, so all three models of the iPhone, all three models of the iPod Touch, and both models of the iPad. However, if you were using a tethered jailbreak on the iPod Touch 3rd Gen, or the iPod Touch 2nd MC, or the iPhone 3GS, uh, using Black Rain or Red Snow uh, on a tethered jailbreak, you must restore on iTunes before you attempt to use this jailbreak. So that means connection to your iPod in iTunes and clicking Restore. Uh, after you restore, you can always sync back your contacts, music, and everything. And I definitely do recommend that you sync at least once before you attempt this jailbreak if you're restored. Otherwise, this might not work uh, because some necessary files aren't on your iPod Touch or iPhone or iPad. Or iPod Touch or iPhone, actually, because you wouldn't have to restore your iPad. Uh, this is not a carrier unlock. This is a jailbreak. Two very different things. An unlock is when you can use it on any SIM card on any network, and a jailbreak is just when you can install third-party applications and themes by getting the uh, third-party application manager. And uh, one last thing is that this will not, I repeat, not delete any of the music, videos, application, contacts, etc. on your iPod Touch or iPhone or iPad. I'll be getting a lot of comments on this um, from people that are scared to do this. This will not wipe out anything on your iPod Touch or iPhone or iPad. It just adds, which is great. So what you want to do is go to the website I have in the description. It's spiritjb.com. And you want to click on either the Windows sign or the Mac OS X sign, obviously whichever operating system you have and you should save the exe to um, any file place. Uh, the file will look like this, spirit.exe. All you need to do is double click. I recommend running it as an administrator. It's always better. And when Windows Vista or 7 asks you for permission, you're obviously going to click allow. When Spirit loads up, you should see a screen here where it says ready and your device and firmware. Now if you don't see this, again, there will be help in the description down there. Um, so please, if you have any uh, errors or anything, uh, look into the description before you comment because uh, this, jailbreak, this jailbreak actually came out a couple of days ago and I've had a lot of problems with it and I found my way around it and the new version here, which is why in the description it says error free. Um, but if you have any problems or anything, read the description. Hopefully, you should find your solution there. But anyways, you want to make sure your iPod Touch is connected. By the way, just to prove to you that I am using the third generation and to prove to you ultimately that this is untethered, as you can see, I have voice control, which means this is the third gen. So what you want to do is make sure you have it connected via USB to your computer. And what you want to do is click Jailbreak. Now let's look on to our iPod Touch. You should see this thing that says Restore in Progress and then Restore Complete, completely normal. And on Spirit, it should say Jailbreak su Succeeded, and you can exit out of the software. We'll look at our iPod Touch for now. It'll show you whatever boot logo you have and we see this screen here that looks sort of like a tie-dye sort of thing and we see a little progress bar moving there showing us that our iPod Touch is jailbreaking iPod Touch, iPhone, or iPad obviously it's just harder to say all three so again guys any problems you're having please look in the description over there I hope I can help you with this video I hope I got a good amount of views on this video because I'm doing it a little late because I want to make it as error free and wait for any updates to come out uh, that will make it as easy as possible for you guys and I'm just thinking right now because I'm connected to iTunes and when you boot up your iPod Touch you should have Cydia installed and then you can open it up and start installing themes, applications and whatever else you want to jailbreak for if you have uh, anything you want to jailbreak for asking what's good just leave a comment down below I'll do my best to get back to you you can always uh, email me um, I get back to you most of the times sometimes it's harder to keep track because I get sometimes fifty or more emails in one day usually with these jailbreak videos so uh, please be uh, patient on those however if you want really instant help um, that you'll definitely get an answer for 
Um, sort of like quick questions, not like comprehensive. Uh, definitely follow me on Twitter down there. Uh, the link will be in the description. And uh, you guys can ask for help or just chat with me and uh, any information you want. And that will all be um, on Twitter. You can also become a fan of my Facebook page. There you get all access help because I'm there to help you, as well as everybody else who's a fan of the page. So it's a great way to get help. And um, the best way to stay informed is to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That will allow you to get all of my new videos on awesome tutorials, reviews, and all kinds of stuff you can do with your newly jailbroken iPod Touch or iPhone. So I definitely recommend that you subscribe, please. Um, also, uh, if you could like this video, give me a thumbs up down there. That would be also much appreciated. And uh, if you really like the video and you want it at your fingertips at any time, make sure to favorite. And I don't want to keep going on and on and telling you what to do. I just hope that I've uh, helped you with this video, guys. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video.